We can not set a new record for dying quickly. Preferably would like to stay away from that. So I'm going right and you're going left, right? Uh, what? <laughs> <laughs> He's trying to get a plan together, jeez. <laughs> Uh, I'm kind of curious as to whether it's actually smart to put my ACU on the front. I'm kind of thinking no. I am not sure. Maybe it could go here, but it should probably yeah, go but if I get, front front. If I get double teamed though, I'm going to just die straight up. So I don't know if that's actually smart. You have a point. So I might just stay in the back and and try to build as many units as possible. Okay, that works, I guess. Are you going for air pretty early? I can. Okay, I think I'm gonna do three land factories and then um, get air online after I get the hydros. I know you probably know this, but they're probably gonna try to drop out here. I well, know technically, Rowie. technically I do know this, but uh, I didn't think of it, so maybe not. <laughs> Thanks, anyways. Uh, we'll just all try not to die together, or both of us will. I'm going to get radar down in the back on my side, so hopefully we can see things coming if shenanigans are pulled. Great, okay. I am um, grabbing the three mixes in between us. You okay. want to take the four mixes in the front? Will do, and I'm going to take this hydro and use it to build air factories. Got it. I think high, uh, power is going to be a major problem. Because there is a lot of reclaim. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, you may want to put like five or six engineers and power spam at some point. Yeah, I'm running the straight for my other hydro over here. Yeah, that's good. Same here. Do we have a connection loss? No, we're good. No, we're good. I like that this map is at least a little bit turtlish. This way, yes. uh, we have the we two have choke a little points. bit of build up time. Yeah. There's three choke points at the front, then two coming to us. But like I said, I'm just really nervous about those outside edges because I know there's a couple of people on the other team that are definitely smart enough to do the drops. So, mildly concerning. Aw, thank you for helping to build my hydro. Of course. Anything for you, Brink. <laughs> oh wait, saying this got you into trouble last time. Why am I repeating it? It's all part of life, repeating one's mistakes. Over and, and over again. Of others. <coughs> Excuse me. See, people don't realize this, but that's why I play so badly on stream. I play so badly so that you guys can learn from it and then not make the same mistake. So really, this is just a sacrifice for all of you and you should be thankful. Wow. That sounds so reasonable. <laughs> all of a sudden. This is how I excuse my mistakes. Thanks, Brain. <laughs> uh... Nuts. If I was vegetarian, you could probably sell meat to me, Brink. Not enough NGs to go around. There's the first scout. I'm getting a scout across my side. It will loop across yours if it doesn't die first. Minus 30 mass, holy cow. Let's get some uh, let's get some reclaim going on here. My guy's spamming. 
Okay, so Orange is not doing terribly much. Semel is on the front line with his ACU. Looks like Purple is straight eco. Rowie is getting air. And there's definitely spam for Dark Blue, like you said. Knowing what they're doing is almost as good as countering it, I think. There's no way we can lose this. No way. No, no way, way, no how, until one of us gets tax sniped. Uh, okay. Actually, you made air after all, and I did not. <laughs> T2 makes this <laughs> important. I'll give you the next air scout. How's that? Oh, uh, that's surprisingly friendly. Thanks, bro. Well, by give it to you, I mean send it over your side of the map. So. Good enough. I was not expecting anything. Playing with Empire has spoiled me. In the sense that I don't really... Okay, whatever. Let's not go into you don't detail. You don't expect anything. There is a land unit up here. Um, just so you're aware, they have killed the front T1 PD, and they're probably going to be reclaiming that. So, I think the reclaim is not too much of a clock unless uh, we forget to reclaim all our rocks. Yeah, I am, but, uh, the I am reclaiming is going to like be a problem. that. I'm actually going to run out of power, I think. Um, need more power over here. I have to pause a couple of these air factories. Yeesh. So expensive. I'm gonna be that guy that builds like 1k worth of power in T1P gens. I think there's no other way of playing this map. <laughs> in fact, I might have to pull even more engineers. I'm gonna have to go for a T2 land factory soon, I think, just for the just for the power. Oh, don't forget TMD as well, because TML yeah. would be nasty. You're there? Oh, yep. you kinda do. Got I me. just spaced out instead of pinging. I'll start giving you uh I'll give you a few of these interceptors so you can use them to guard your edge. Thank you. Much appreciate it. Yes, finally broke even on power. Here you go. Thanks. You are very welcome. Just don't forget that T2. So you are Aeon. I'm gonna build these. I love large-scale air production, it's so much fun. So that's what people do when they don't have swift winds. <laughs> yep. Oh, I'm here giving you interceptors, and you're over here with the ability to build swift winds. Why I think that's perfectly fine. Taking advantage of me so. Um, it's for the great you're good, which is T2 mixes. <laughs> okay, I guess I can't argue there. Get a few of those myself here. How many do you have already? Like, seven so far? I have five, and two more about to complete, so... You are definitely ahead of where I'm at. Do I build T2 P gens first or TMD first? I think TMD would probably be the smarter choice. Yeah, doing the same. 
I don't see any T2 air factories, but there is a T2 land factory, and I'm also highly uncomfortable with the amount of land units that are right here. Yeah. I got some land on my side too. Uh, it's kind of okay. not holding. I'm gonna go for pillars so we actually have some mobile units. I might be dead, Brink. Oh no. No! <laughs> don't, don't do this to me. I know, I, I didn't last long. It's because your fans are too good at this game, Brink. Come on, come on, you can survive it. I'm trying. Do you need overcharge? I have it. Okay, do you need power to feed your overcharge? I have it. I also okay. have epic place type. Oh, I love the point defense down there. That's awesome. Uh, beware uh... the units coming from the north. Oh, uh, and the air coming from... Okay, I'm sending pillars your direction now. Thanks. Bringing all of my air in, so we should be able to double team him, and I've now got bombers online. There is an ACU over there as well, so be careful. I am, thank you. Where did my other T2 engineers go? Are you good now, or do you need me to keep bringing units over to your side? I think I'm good, thank you. Okay. But they are retreating for whatever reason. Yeah, I wasn't sure about that myself. Let's go see what's going on over here. Oh, they are coming to my side, hello. Oh. Okay, sending stuff to your side then. No, that's fine. Maybe I got it. Honor. I got it. You got it? Yeah. They might sweep my uh, forward-facing expansions, but I definitely have enough pillars to stop them on the ramps. Your T1 is no match for me. Get out of here. Oh, that's where they went. I am still wary of drops, because... There is one on my side right now, but it's dying. Good. They do have a T2, two T2 air factories on the other side. Oh, that's fire beetles. Yeah, confusing. Not so much. I mean, it's effective. I just don't see these a lot right now in the current balance. I may not see. may not have enough engineers. Shame on me. Nice scouting. There's some T2 air. Ah, it's fine. What kind of T2 air? Bombers? Uh, just a factory. I assume okay. it's for gunship, since it's Seraphim. I'm gonna come over here and see what I can clear up. Might win myself a little reclaim, which would be very nice.
And there's the tag missiles. They killed uh, some of the team D in the front, I think. Yeah. Yeah, I see but it. I've got one up. on the front, but at least I didn't upgrade those mexes. No, that's good. He killed my hydro. He spent a tack missile on a hydro. What? Technically, almost worth it. Or not. I mean, in my current power situation, definitely a waste, but I suppose it didn't know what my current power situation was. It could possibly be worth it. Oh, well, that's a lot of tanks, actually. Uh, I'm gonna back up. They've got mobile missile launchers up on the ridge. They got some Corsairs over here. Alright. Like three, four. Well, that's not pleasant. Do I still have any of those bombers left? I do not. Crap. I might... No, I'm good. Never mind. I'm about to have a bunch of production roll online, so I should be fine. I did lose my radar on this side though, which is very unfortunate. Come on, Titans, be useful! Well, they were. Okay, thank you for dealing with that artillery drop. I did not even see it. Yeah, it was not a drop. <laughs> oh, they just yeah, came sure. through? Yeah. Okay. Well, nonetheless, thank you for dealing with it. Of course. Do I start spamming Percivals? I think yes. It is always a good time to start spamming Percivals. Yeah, if Percivals is a question, the answer is yes. Oh, 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 no, no. Oh. I have so many units right now, it is not even funny. Oh, hello, Corsair. My Mercy Slide just failed. That and is a Janus, not a Corsair. Going for my build power. Well, kudos on the good hit. That was actually well done. Purple's moving up on that side again. Watch yourself. Yes, thanks. Yeah, this is fine. You okay? Yeah, thanks. Alright. Wow, my titans are actually wrecking. They are quite handy versus T1. My own little lump of carnage. It is so hard to hit the stupid 
mobile missile launchers on terrain this rough. Okay, so I think I'm good on this side. I need to get... I need to get some radar online, though. In a bad kind of way. Higher tier. Maybe we can find some reclaim. That should be a lot. Yep. I'm about to key one of my factories over to, um... Over to reclaim engineers as opposed to combat units. Aww, my trusty titans died. That's lame. That's a lot of Ilshis, damn. You gonna be okay? Yeah, just losing harps I shouldn't be losing. Okay. I'm still mildly concerned. Uh, terminal is probably gonna go Ravagers. Now that I'm looking at it. I'm gonna go, um, I'm gonna go T3 artillery spam in the middle to prevent that. Oh, we got gunships. Should be fine, I got plenty of air. And Percival's coming in, so also should be good. There I'm attacking the guy in the center is a high oh. likelihood of T3 oh, air soon. Yeah, I see the factory. Can we take out orange? Can we take out orange? Yeah. Probably. Where is he? He only <laughs> has T1 anti-air. Um, oh, he has a T3, T3 air factory in the back. I, I don't, don't see his matter. ACU. Oh, that's way too much T1 PD. Let me back up. Can you hit the PD? Yes, thank you. I'm gonna factory lock him. And then as soon as the PD is gone, I can take all of that. Thank you very much indeed. Anytime. Oh crap, purple got in. I wasn't paying attention. Me neither. Sorry for that. Dang it. We don't have Vinto on the orange, I see. It's very irritating. Yeah, I know. I'm trying to figure out what happened to it, but... I don't see him anywhere. Can you put gunships on those tanks, if you don't mind? Uh, yeah. I think you selected all of your gunships and went somewhere else. There's only T1 mexes on the front, because that kept getting hit, so it's not that much of a loss. I'm gonna I kill all this build power. Loads of Ilshivas on the right still. Take out some power generators. My ACU is stuck. There we go. Oh, that was such I a placed move. a move order over there ages ago to go and kill the stupid things, but now I'm in range of an overcharge. There we go. Good deal. Orange uh, took shelter under the shields on the right. Blue and, uh, is pulling back. Or purple is redirecting his units over to my side, I should say. Less than ideal. Not the end of the world.
Come on, Percival, save me. First of all, I should say. Ah, uh, there's another round coming up in the back. It's all good. Damn, that's, uh, that's pretty good. That is there's an a, upgraded uh, ACU. Advanced nano ACU in the center. Yeah. Did not realize it was upgraded that much. Coming with air. Same here, but I did lose my hearts for no reason. What are those, Corsairs? They are Corsairs. Some of my interceptors are now running out of fuel. Oh, there is so much mass. Holy cow. Oh, he's tack missling. No! <laughs> what did you lose? Ah, all all the of my factors. air factories. Uh, that uh, side is totally shot. exposed. Let me get a Sparky back out here. I gotta get these rebuilt. I totally forgot. I was thinking, oh, it's no problem because I don't have anything valuable over there. You need to get T3 air production online, I think. Uh, would you mind? I don't think I have enough power. Yeah, I'm on it. I'll hold interceptor production. I'm also pulling... Um, let's see, you guys are going to come reclaim. I'm also doing the T3 mobile artillery in the middle to start hammering the bases back where they can't advance. Should work out okay. This is a pretty nasty job. Uh-oh. What is it? What kind of units, Jeez. you know? Yeah, it's all Ilshis. Wow. I mean, kudos to him. He's, uh, thinking. It's gonna take a while to kill, especially if there's flak over there. He does. He has flak with it. Watch it. Dang, that totally negated your ability to use use those gunships effectively. Well, I'm killing the flak and I'm going back in. It's not so bad, I think. Well, at least I think I'm frustrating him with the uh, with the T3 artillery in the middle. Another leak right here. I'm coming around on my side to take back what needs it, but. I think we got a lot of reclaim on the right side. Can you send Are the gunships on... right here, please? Yes, sure. Thank you. Um, you probably need to get like a factory up top, not only Sparky. Okay. So you can reclaim more. More units coming from the center. Watch these. Yeah, thanks. And purple has got Percivals now in quite a goodly number. They've got T3 Mexes on their side, quite a few. How many T3 Max do you have? Uh, I don't know. Ten? Okay. Strats. See it? I'm not going to be able to get to it in time. Do you have air? 
Yeah, I do. Late reaction though. Should have sent okay. it. <laughs> All right, I got all my interceptors refueled, and we're building again. Debating, I think I'm gonna get two more, two more T3 maxes, and then shift to full T3 production. I'm getting a fair bit of reclaim right now, so should be able to make this work pretty dang well. I'm uh, pushing on the right side. Excellent. There's another transport loaded with Ilshivas right there. I know there's flak, but uh, just so you know. Thank you. He is all T3 mechs over here on the core, and all of those factories have shifted to T3. I don't think they can kill the GC anytime soon, but... Uh... Just be careful, because I know there were at least maybe seven or eight Percivals over here. All right. They are certainly and going to And there's more Percivals on the front as well. I might actually need some gunships. I'll send them to That would be massively helpful. He's going to kill all my Artie off. Awesome, thank you very much. Of course. Percival's moving to your side. And we got Ravagers on the front. Gunships pushed him back, so we're good there. The GC is working so far. Good. I think we have a kill. Yes, we do. We do. Awesome! You got Corsairs on your GC? Yeah, got a flock coming up. Um, they do have T2 artillery in range of your power generators on the front line. Might want to get more oh. shields. Yeah, thanks. Oh, that Going is to do that. gorgeous. Beautiful. Uh, I'm gonna scout the center here and prioritize targets. Not actually sure where the T2 artillery is. Another kill? Oh man! <laughs> And overcharge. Dang it. Ether artillery too strong. That might actually be more point defense than I want to bite into. Yeah, let's back up. I got T3 air all over the place now. Strap bomber! I know I have sniper boss on my side, I just don't know where. Strap bomber in my base, please help. Yep, yeah, it's going over my flock in a second. Oh man. Oh, there's not actually that much stuff here. Just that one stupid T3 artillery that is wrecking my face. 
me back up. Percival's on your comm. Look out. Yeah, I am. I am. I you have double shield or just one? Yeah, double shield. Okay. Because that is sketchy. I think it's okay. Nicely done clearing the right side. Hey, um, if you have T2 air, maybe drop some Arby's over the cliff or... No, there's a lot of ASF over there. Strat. Yeah, thanks. But it uh, looks fine so far. Uh, get new defense if you can. I'm already building it. It's right in the middle. Great. I have one uh, at the bottom. Covers to here. Okay, great. Alright, I just got my army of Percivals online, so I should be able to push in and get business taken care of over here. He is getting a lot of reclaim on the front there. Maybe can kill those? Also, what is this dot? Percival? That looks like a Percival. I think a Percival, yeah, it is. Okay. My biggest fear right now is that there is going to be a... Um, a fat boy, because I think that is the thing we're least equipped to deal with. I'm more concerned about uh, T4 bomber, actually. Um, scouts across the center. Maybe I'm just stupid, but where is the artillery he's hitting me with? I don't see it anywhere. I'll check some. Um, the stationary yard. Can you swing the GC this way when you get done? Oh, never mind. They turned yep. back. Oh, I see it. Yeah, it's just me being stupid. Okay. That's comforting to know. Alright, Percival's coming in as well. I think I have enough Percivals here to break this line. They are making a fat boy over here. It's, uh... I can't tell. Being built. <laughs> Dang it! We had that extra shield, it's just not gonna be enough. Ah! Gotta come up with a way to break that defense there. Also, Percival's in on the front again. Okay. They are really uh, land-based. I'm uh, quite happy. They haven't punished us for not making more. Yes. Okay, I got Percival's on them. I think I'll be fine, actually. I'm ahead two shots on there, so... Ah, and your Harbing Harbingers as well. Good deal. Is that a chicken? Where? That might be a chicken. Ping it, please. Yeah, that's a chicken. Uh, top left or what? Top. Yeah, top left. Um. I'm running back. I should have... He's keeping it defensive. I should have enough Percivals right. to hold here, so I don't think that's that much of an issue. 
I think if he comes to me, he's doomed. Chicken on your side as well? Oh, yeah, that's too bad. Hold on. That's and so Rowie bad. is there with his calm. You know what I just realized? What? You killed the Cybrans, so we don't have to worry about Telemazers. They could be Seraph and Telemazer. That's true. Why you gotta be such a bummer, man? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Here I am, getting all hopeful that we are gonna get killed by something stupid, and... Nope. Nope, you're absolutely yeah. still gonna get it. I mean, I mean, they could also make a teleport support ACU with, uh... Onboard TML. This is also true. Dang it, man! You just keep making it worse. <laughs> <laughs> That's how I stay alive. I'm afraid of everything, bro. I am afraid to upgrade things on the front line too much because then things might die. Also, your T3 P gens are still getting shelled by those artillery. Shields are holding. Alright, I just saw you had damage on one of them, so I was a little concerned for you. Yeah, thanks. Good hint. I'm gonna try to build up to a critical mass of T3 artillery and take out the base in the middle, and then try to wreck the ACUs that are there. Because if I can get... Actually, you might be able to help with that. If you push your Harbingers to the edge of the cliff, can they fire down? I think they can. I'm trying that. Because I now have 23 Percivals, which should be able to one-shot an ACU. I'm going to move in so the Ravagers don't... Well... You're going to distract the Ravagers for my personals moving in. That's how this is going to work. Um, we may need an air solution for the chicken on the north side. A very expensive distraction. There is a chicken. Okay. I'm just going to move in and then go after the ACU. Sure. I might be able to KO him. Oh, he's got the shield. Dang it. I'm gonna back he up. He could still die. No, no, no. Chicken's too close. Chicken's too close. I did get, though. We are oh, good. nice with the GC! He, get, he took at least six Percival shots, so you can probably yeah, get through his shield. Yeah, he's stuck in the chicken. <laughs> oh, that is beautiful. Oh, but he's behind it now. He's body blocking with the chicken. I'm coming in. I'm coming in. Because one way or the other, my uh, Percivals can be very useful in this situation. I'm hitting the chick uh, chicken back, and uh, I think I think we can kill it, actually. I'm going after the commander. <laughs> what a situation, man. Wow. Just look at the chicken. Strat. Rat. Oh wow, I'm actually positive on mass. Ooh! Oh, good hint. Oh my god. What'd you do? I have so chicken, much. Chicken, 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 another chicken. Yes. I'm on that one. I am now firing on his ACU, I think. Yes, you can kill him. I'm definitely gonna try. Thank goodness for... Why aren't your Harbingers shooting at him? Are your Harbingers on hold fire? No. They are not. Uh, then why aren't they shooting him? Maybe they aren't mine. I don't really understand what's going on there. What are you looking at? This chicken is dying, if you mean that. Alright, uh, chicken in the center. I'm backing up.
Oh, I was positive on mass because of reclaim. That's what it was. That's okay, Same though. Here. I will take advantage of the situation. My nuke defense is now loaded enough that by the time one travels over here, it'll be good. Speaking of nuke defense, what should I nuke? Uh, don't know. Don't have T3 scouts. I'm gonna go move on blue. Over here. Okay. That seems good. Um, also ASF on this side now, which is not There's all that especially power. grand. There's a fat boy over here. Okay. I'm nuking a uh, purple base. Uh, fat boy on my side as well, unless you're talking about the same fat boy. Same fat boy. Okay. I am gonna have a little bit of a hard time stopping all of this. Do you want some mass? Yeah. I can take some. Okay, good. Oh, there was a commander in it! He did not move away. The orange what? commander was sitting there. <laughs> Wow. Okay. Game over. Easy. Nice. Well, that's one chicken down. Slowly but surely, picking them clean. Gotta move up to the front. Once I actually get in range, I've got so much T3 artillery. I should be able to absolutely wreck everything on in the base in there. Bring some shields and maybe some uh, T3 mobile onto there. Uh, Fat Boy is a concern though. I'm going to try to push him with the T3 mobile artillery. Might be able to land enough shots. Also, he's running towards us. You should be able to get it with the GC. I think he's running in to meet his fate, actually. His ACU is coming. Nope, he's running back. He was actually trying for it. Ah, that's a lot of T3 artillery shells. Come on, come on. Get your ACU in range. Oh, your shield is down. Hello. No, it's not. No, it's not. He still got shield. Yeah, he just lost a bit of HP out there. But that was smooth. Alright, he's out. I expected out. more. I expected more T2 bombers in our faces for some reason, but... I know! Hey, cool. I was really surprised by the lack of pressing advantages. The drops were pretty good. They did do some damage there. Oh, you have two chickens. Also got uh, two GCs. I'll come save you with my T1 bombers. <laughs> you underestimate my power. Okay, I'll wait for it. Okay, they're not gonna kill it that quickly. <laughs> <laughs> also, there's ASF over there, which might cause issues. I mean, I've got a good, you know, 3,000 damage maybe? What is it, 300? No, not that much then. Yeah, it would. 300 times 21 would be about 6,000. Small dense, but a dense nonetheless. 
the strongest chicken weapon just went in between the two GCs, hitting none of them. Oh, that's amazing. Yeah. Got out of it scot so free. Oh my god. Just don't die to the lightning. Yeah. Thanks. I'm not Tokido, okay. <laughs> I mean, I'm just saying. You can never tell about some of you 1700 ranks. <laughs> <laughs> It's good to be cautious. You know what it's time for? My own totally unnecessary fat boy that I now finally have the mass to build. Sure. I mean... What is your income, by the way, out of curiosity? Uh, 460 right now. Holy smokes! Yeah, you got me, you got me passed. I think that's mainly... Oh, you've got T3 mexes all the way out across your edge. Yeah, yeah I, don't, true. I don't have that. I did forget some, though. GG. Hey, G that was nice. G. That is going to wrap everything up for this video, guys. If you enjoyed it, feel free to drop a like and share it with someone. If you want to support the channel, catch the streams, or join the Discord, check out the links in the description. Thank you all for being at least partially insane, and I will see you in the next one.